Evelyn. How are you? Been better? No short crying. There was enough crying people already. You look good today? It's too good. If you want to say something, just say it right now. Alright, well, I think we should discuss what we're going to do with Dad's house. Ah, uh, I see. That's what it was about. No. I already know people we can sell it to. They're married couple. No kids. Wait, I don't think you realize we're discussing our parents' home here. Our home. We're good to get rid of that place. We had some good time there. You had some good time there. I hated me. But you were the only one that was ever on my side. Thank you. They weren't perfect. But you know, they cared. Even when you lost your phone in Mexico, they were so worried about you. We had a fight before that trip. Mom was saying how I don't think about others, and Dad said he didn't think I'm his daughter. And then, I remember being in Mexico City the day after losing my phone. I was in some grim 24-hour bar opposite the shuttle to the airport. Nobody in the world knew where I was. And then suddenly I had the thought that I could just stay there. You know, sometimes it's so appealing to get lost. I realized it when I came back and you said that mom died. I didn't go to the funeral. I wanted to get lost again. Evelyn. Do you think he's watching us? I don't know. Probably not. Do you think he and Mom are together? I bet they already had a fight. I feel like I wasted so much time. It's hard to believe that it's just the two of us. <laughs> 